Alright, and here we go with the first match of the night. To Jerry taking on Edge to kick off the show. And what is gonna be a spectacular match? And here we go. DC Dirty World Tag Team Champs. Crazy Tony and Tajiri making their way down the ring. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from Tokyo, Japan. Weighing in at 198 pounds. One half of the World Tag Team Champions. Buzzsaw. Crazy Tony Woods in the King of the Ring tournament, but got eliminated by Mike Awesome. Now, I just keep quiet during both Crazy Tony and Tajiri and Crazy Tony by himself and Sting's entrance because I just like the entrance. Because both things, I put the court thing on it. I'm interested. It's a good thing, so. I like hearing it. Peaceful. Boy, right, here comes Edge. Down the ring. His opponent from Toronto, Ontario, Canada. Weighing in at 249 pounds. The rated R. And Edge advanced in the King of the Ring tournament. He's going on in the round two of the tournament. And what I see right here, it looks like he's going to face Batista tomorrow on Raw. And boy, that's going to be a spectacular match. And Lance Storm will face off against Buff Bagwell. And Kishi will face off against Scott Steiner. And Bill and Scott Hall. We see Chris Benoit in our main event taking on Matt Hardy. They on tonight on Heat. And here we go. To Jerry and Edge. Oh! On you know, NWA, we got Randy Savage versus Bret Hart. James Storm and Hulk Kogan. <sighs> DDP and AJ and Styles and CJ. ECW, we got T Rex and Jeff Hardy, Rock and Hillbilly Ken, Mick Foley and Abyss. Oh, wow, that's going to be a good one. And Wade and Mike Awesome. And on SmackDown, we got Vampiro and Ultimo Dragon. 
Undertaker and Dave, Cena and Val Venus, and Tucker Michinoku and AJ Young. Now, if I, I might switch the matches around, probably. Might switch it around. Not guaranteed, but it might. Here now. Oh, no on, there's. Yes. Man, Jerry's just working on it, and there's now gets right back up, and to Jerry. Send him right back down. Jerry now over the arm bar. Okay. That's now gets out of it. Jerry's the prizer. Yeah, suplex by the radar superstar edge. Jerry now, uh oh. Oh boy, oh no, oh an edge! See they're coming out on a clothesline. Yeah, I was gonna go for the cover, look crazy Tony just watching on. Kick out. Oh uh, edge now stalking to Jerry. He's gonna go for that spin and close the close up. Oh my gosh! What a spear! Dang! Oh, it's a Jerry, come on, step it up. My goodness. Just like that, and Edge picks up the victory. Jerry did a good job, though. But he's not able to pick up the win. Oh, the Rated R Superstar. Here's your winner, the Rated R Superstar, Edge. Edge picks up the win over to Jerry. And we're going to kick off the show of heat. Still a lot more action to come. Ladies and gentlemen, here we go to the next match. Patrick going against El Mago Jr. in a squash opponent, match. Representing the Million Dollar Corporation from Hollywood, Florida. Weighing in at 225 pounds. One half of the Patrick. And Patrick along with Ted at TNA Lockdown will defend the TNA Tag Titles against the Rock Roll Express. Yeah, it'll just be time matches. No King Ring Tournament. Match on there, just be tall matches. So no, the King of the Tournament will not happen on TNA and NWA lockdown. Here we go, Patrick. Oh my god, Junior. Oh! Patrick, I was, 
<laughs> Gotta give him a singles push. I wouldn't even be mad if they dropped the towels. After they lose the towels to the Rock World Express. That actually helped me a little bit more. To be honest. I gotta give Patrick a singles push, man. This I, I gotta get. I'm lucky to just giving that in May for him. Ugh. Stevens. Jeff. Bizarre. You know? And Patrick! Oh! Look at him. Got changed. Ever since he got that new haircut. Oh! No. Yeah. Oh, Patrick. Oh, I should have put Patrick in the king during tournament. That would have been a lot better. Well, if AJ, oh! Or if CJ gets injured, then he could replace him. But Patrick and Ted would defend. NWA TNA Tag Tiles. Against, oh! Man. Rock Roll Express, and that's gonna be a good one. And a tornado tag match. Uh, just regular tag matches take too long. Oh! What a jammer. Look at Patrick! My God! Oh! 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 Look at Patrick now! Oh! What the, oh! And oh my gosh! I had to give him that. That it was too dope. One, two. Three and Patrick picks up the win. I caught the mischief lariat, the mischief lariat, I guess. Huh? Call that. Here is I gotta think of a name. Patrick. Look at this crazy guy, man. Patrick picks up the win. All right, next match. And here we go with the next match on Sunday Night Heat. And you hear that? Shawn Michaels. He can no champion. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring. San Antonio, Texas, weighing in at 227 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels! Here it comes. Now we the NWO X Pop. And his opponent representing the NWO from Minneapolis, Minnesota. Weighing in at 212 pounds, x This is going to be going x pot Shawn Michaels, one-on-one. -on -one. Two click members. It's a little click. Mm. 
Here we go. It's gonna be going Shawn Michaels and X Pac. Oh, Shawn Michaels. Also, it came to the ring. Shawn Michaels will defend. Oh. The Incontinental Championship against Christian. That's going to be going. Christian and Shawn Michaels. It went top. Next part. That's for just stopping away on Shawn Michaels. Oh! Now we sleep, bro. Now, oh! Well, if X Pac wins, I'd probably add him in that match. doing out here and Shawn Michaels like what the hell are you doing out here man and I guess X Pac is respectful and he's not going to attack Shawn Michaels I see yep he respect oh well you know oh, I think Shawn Michaels about to do something to Christian and Christian like you know what just forget it I'm out of here and Christian leaves and X Pac had the opportunity to attack Shawn Michaels but I guess X Pac this Shawn Michaels was his boy back in the day. It still is a little bit. Three. Shawn Michaels don't got no problem anymore with the NWO. He squashed that beef for Kevin Nash. Four. The NWO is looking for some recruit next day. Shawn Michaels could join the NWO. That'd be exciting to see. Somebody's a part of the NWO, the black and white. I am thinking about just bending the NWO though, I ain't gonna lie, to be honest with you. But that's probably gonna be after Survivor Series. Seven or five men just go their separate ways. Think about putting Kevin Nash and Scott Hall on NWA TNA. Well, this is where they were you know, in 2004, and we were in T on TNA in 2004, so. Hey, Spock was too, I think. Yeah, he was too. Could put a best on there, but no, I'll keep best on ECW right quick for a little while. Then I have to download. Uh, no, not download. But I'm going to add by root. Good. Look at Shawn Michaels now. Got X Pac. Kick out. X 
factor. Oh, Sean Myers. Oh, woo! And Sean Myers got saved right there. Sean Michaels got saved, man. Oh. Sean Michaels legit got saved. I, that was close. now. Next spot. You're on top. Oh! This could be it. He be in the match. And, oh, whoo, oh my goodness. And kick out for Shawn Michaels. Man, X Factor, oh my gosh, this could be it. Shawn Michaels, oh no. Oh, and a kick out. Next play, tried it. Shawn Michaels now. Ooh. That suplex, yes. Shawn Michaels now, what is he gonna do? Oh, what a chop. Oh, oh God. But just this is a good match so far. But it just keeps coming back, man. Can't take down the X Pac in the clothesline. Shop shooter, no shop shooter, no. Uh -uh. Next part, next part, we want to be added to the Continental Championship match, and I don't blame him. No! Oh! You're making a triple threat. This could be it. Two and a kick out from the Heartbreak Kid, Shawn Michaels. Next part, stalking him. Looking for the X Factor. The X Factor might end it. Oh! Oh, yep, that's it, that's it, that's game. That's game. x pack can be added to the Intercontinental Championship match. Yes, he is. He is adding to the Intercontinental Championship match. Now is a triple threat. x pack Christian, and Shawn Michaels for the Intercontinental Championship at King of the Ring.
No, era algo que yo, And here we go. It's a women's action. The following contest oh. is scheduled for. Oh, 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 oh! Is the ECW Women's Show? Oh! oh, my goodness. Well, oh! Oh, my God. Jazz is out here. What the heck? Oh! Uh, Josie Jane! Oh! These two face off in the corner ring tournament. Second round. No. Come on, Jazz. Wait a minute, it's not even a match. Yo, Jazz for the face trust Jazz. Wait, what the heck is going on? Is this a match? I don't did I hit the bell ring? I don't know. I, don't, I forgot. I don't know if I hit the bell ring or not. Could be tripping. Isn't that special master? It's supposed to be Jane versus Trish Stratus, but I don't know. I guess Jazz attacked Trish Stratus backstage. This is, this is actually a match now. What? This is actually a match! Wow! Oh my god! Never mind, that one ain't. Okay, I'm gonna say. And. Matt Hardy vs. Chris Benoit! Main event time! That's the World the Tag Team Champs. Is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring, accompanied by Jeff Hardy, representing the Hardy Boys. From Cameron, North Carolina, weighing in at 236 pounds, one half of the World Tag Team Champions, Matt Hardy! And his opponent from Calgary, Alberta, Canada, weighing in at 220 pounds, Chris. Here comes the one and only Chris Benoit. Yeah, that's it. Rabbit Wolverine. Here we go, and silent. Here we go, and a giant suplex. Oh, from Benoit. Oh man, Benoit just going to work on Matt Hardy right now. Oh. You know, they attacked it. No one's backing down here. What an impact. Come on now. Headlock locked in. Got a headlock locked in on him. And if they want to get out of it, 
Smart. Uh. Oh. Oh man, it's been a hell kick. And a suplex. Oh! And the rest of next week. Ducks it. Oh, the clothesline. Now going up top. Oh! My oh, heart's seen that Dolph Nobo coming. And the mat now. Oh! Takes him down. Nick Wrench. <laughs> oh! I think Jeff Hart jumped up like a cheerleader. Oh, look at Benoit now, Benoit. Oh! This could be bad for Matt. Matt Hardy now gets it out of it. Oh, gosh, we're shot. Benoit, one of my favorite technical wrestlers of all time. One of my favorite wrestlers of all time. One of the best to ever step foot inside the squirrel circle. A professional wrestling ring. And up! Oh! Man, there's one. Two. And another German. Oh, and the last one. Oh! Crossface locked in! Uh, Matt Hardy, Matt Hardy might tap here! Matt Hardy might tap! Is he gonna tap? Is Matt Hardy gonna tap? Oh, Matt Hardy now get out of it! Matt Hardy got out of the crossface! Oh, oh, the suplex! Oh, that was nice! Oh, and the kick out for Benoit! And a side effect. Side effect. Oh! And then good comes from the side effect. My heart right now. Oh, he ain't going for a pen. Oh, shocker. What are you going to do? Twist fate? Never mind. Going out. Got some more with a belly belly overhead. And boom on now. Cover. And kick out. Now twist the fate. Twist the fate. Seal your fate. Oh! That could be it right there. Twist the fate can end it. Could be it for Bill Wan. Oh, and Bill Wan kicks out. Wait, is Mel Hart going to have to do the take down cross Bill Wan? Oh, 
go. Oh man. Side effect, oh my god. That could be it for doing right there, no stamina. Oh, he got stamina back now, but that could be it for him right there. A kick out. And now my heart is stalking him. Yeah, twist the fate. That could be it right there. One, two, Three. Man. We're a match, though. Here is your winner, Matt Hardy! Well, Matt Hardy picks up the win, not main event, and in a great match. What's the word over Benoit, though? Alright, thanks for watching Heat. Like, comment, subscribe, and see y'all.